This is Cell Division Mitosis. It is by me, I'm Jack, Parker, and Mikey. In prophase, the, chrom the chromosomes condense and become visible. The nuclear membrane breaks down and spindle fibers form at opposite ends of the poles. Then to the next phase, prometaphase. Nuclear mem membrane breaks apart into membrane vesicles. Micro tubules connect to the chromosomes. Then to the next phase, metaphase. The chromatids line up in the center of the cell. Right here. Then the spindle fibers connect, as you can see, the fibers. With the centrioles, and pull them to the poles, which the poles are right here and right here. Then to the next phase, anaphase. This is the stage of mitosis and meiosis in which the chromosomes move to the opposite poles, opposite ends of the nuclear spindle. Those are the chromosomes, and they're moving that way and that way, the opposite ends. The next phase, telophase. The chromosomes spread out in a triangle, like this, and like that. The nuclear membrane reforms there, there, and the spindle breaks apart, and nucleus becomes visible in the daughter cells. So nucleus is right there and right there. The next phase, cytokinesis. Cytokinesis is the final stage of mitosis. The cytoplasm divides, and The cell splits apart by almost pinching it off. The cytoplasm is disconnecting right here and right here. And now you have two, one, two identical daughter cells. One thing I need to mention about telophase, as you can see right here and right here, that is called the cleavage furrow. Just a quick vocab word. Cleavage furrow. And that is all on mitosis. Thank you for listening. This is a sketch of mitosis. Cancer cells attach on to their hosts rapidly and devour the normal cells, like this diagram. Like HeLa cancer tumor, cancer attacks cells very rapidly. It attacks them so fast that we don't have time to react. Cancer cells have affected the world today in many ways. There are a lot of cancer survivors, but there are a lot of cancer victims and they sometimes fight it and do well and they sometimes do not make it. Cancer is the worst disease in the world and it affects everyone on the planet. Our current event is on cancer of course and it is it is saying that all cancers are different and the reason that we haven't found a cure was because they are all different, so they all need another cure for each type of cancer or a different type of treatment for each type of cancer. And this talk to this current event talked about all of the types of cancers and how they affect you and how what type of treatment process. But the overall cure, when you just ask that question, just why, why isn't there a cure for cancer? There is not one yet because. There are too many types of cancer to determine one single cure for every single type.